Hey guys, it's Kelly, and today I'm filming a new video. Hey guys, it's Kelly, it's Kelly, and this is Brenda. Hey guys, it's Kelly. Hey guys, it's Kelly. So in today's video, I'm sure you can tell by the title, my dog just sneezed, I'm really sorry. Um, I'm going to be doing a September favorites. So in this video, I'm just be showing you some things that I loved in this this month of September. A lot of them I'm not actually going to be holding up to show you just because it's kind of hard, but I will have everything linked down below if I can find it, obviously. Also, if you didn't know, I said that my dog is making noise. Um, I'm actually vlogging today and my vlog will be up after this video and that's what I'm showing you about him. I'm not going to show you him in this video just because I do want to leave it for that video. But obviously if you follow me on Instagram, which if you don't, it's Kellyanne underscore Hastings, you've already seen him. This is going to be really hard to film because he is obviously really wanting attention and if you see him, then you see him. I'm just going to get straight on to the video and the first few things that I don't have to actually show you are one is the Shark Rocket, which is our new vacuum. If you've watched our Clean With Me's, then you know what vacuum I'm talking about. And obviously I'll have my Clean With Me's linked down below just because I'm mentioning them. That Shark Rocket is so good. It picks up everything and I'm sure it's gonna get even better with this dog because he likes to leave all of his uh, dog food everywhere. So hope the next thing I have to talk about is actually my tripod. I will have it linked down below. We got it this month and it was like 40 bucks on Amazon, which honestly is a lot of money, but um, I've been wanting to use my old camera, which is what I'm using right now, which is the Canon Rebel T3i. And I have like little tripods because I have like a little vlogging camera and it it's too heavy for that so we got this really sturdy one and it's like very very sturdy and it goes pretty high I think it goes to like about my height and I'm 5'7 5'8 and yeah it's really really nice I would definitely recommend it if you have like a heavier camera or if you just want to get into filming more I think it's really amazing so yeah then the next thing I have to talk about is actually my microphone and the little like fuzzy thing on top of it um, both of them are from Amazon. I think combined it was 28 bucks, which is not bad at all. It, honestly, like, let me know if you think the quality is good, like the mic quality. Um, yeah, I think it's pretty good for 28 bucks. Um, yeah, I definitely do not regret buying it because there's a lot of background noise from, like, outside my apartment complex and also just in here, and I just wanted to have a more clear audio and also the Canon Rebel T3i or just the Canon cameras in general I feel like don't have the best microphone internally so I wanted to have an external one just because I used to use this camera and people used to complain all the time that they couldn't hear me so yeah it was definitely something that I wanted to fix by using this. So the next thing I wanted to talk about is my planner. I got this new planner. It's by the brand Dana Lee Collection. It has little hearts on it and it says her greatest power is believing in herself. I think it's really cute. I have like videos planned. I don't know if all of these videos are definitely going to like stay here because um, I don't know if you also knew I got really sick in September like last week and like I couldn't film so like that's why I missed like last Wednesday and Friday. Definitely wasn't intentional. I had like the worst sore throat um, so yeah but yeah, like I have like little sticky notes. I used to write it down, but then like I didn't want to film the videos that I had written down, so I have sticky notes now. The next thing, um, I'm just gonna put this with planners because like it's kind of like techy. I got some blue light glasses. Um, I do strictly online school, so I need blue light glasses. I don't need them, but I also have like really bad eyesight. Also, if you have seen my other videos where I've talked about how blind I am while doing my makeup, I got contacts. So it's a very good thing. Also, I'm not wearing them right now because they're not my right prescription yet because I got like trial ones. And I'm also not wearing my new glasses that I got because they're not my right prescription. I feel like they're too strong and they give me like the worst migraine. But yeah, I'll have a link down below for these. I'm sorry, I went on like a little tangent. But um, yeah, I'll have the link down below for these. These are like 16 bucks on Amazon. They feel like 16 bucks. They are like super plasticky, but they work. So like that's all that really matters. The next weird thing, it's not weird, but um, 
something that I've never heard of before. Actually, one of my friends that I met out here in San Diego, if you're watching this, Angela, hi, um, sells Norwex like products and I got these like makeup wipes and they're they say like body on them but you literally just put water on them and then wipe off your makeup and I swear these work so amazing these work so good like I used it for the first time last night and when I say like it's now already my favorite it's now already my favorite because I always have to go buy a ton of makeup wipes and sometimes they always irritate my face because I have the most sensitive skin and um, also they don't they leave so much residue that I always have to use like two pumps worth of two or two times worth of my toner to get like all the makeup off but I swear after using these I only had to use my toner once and like there was only a little bit of makeup like it wasn't like normal like normally I'll put the makeup wipe on and, and like be like that's gross and then put my toner on and be like what? did it take off anything but this time like it was like a full face of makeup yesterday too I'm really excited to see if it works for today because I did a little bit more makeup just because I'm filming but yeah these are pretty expensive but honestly like when you think about it like you can reuse these all the time and then also you just wash them it's a lot more cost effective than buying makeup remover so I'll have a link down below maybe I'll text Angela today and see if I can like put her link to see if like she can get commission or something because I think she gets commission when you buy through her link but I honestly would recommend these so much I think it came with three for 18 which isn't too bad and it's also a lot more safe for your skin also Norwex in general is safer than like most cleaning supplies next I'm gonna be moving on into the makeup and the first product I have is the elf hydrating face primer I got this I want to say at the end of July but I think I've like recently started really liking it it just like makes me a I want to say I have film, but that sounds gross on top of my skin before I put my makeup on. And it kind of just makes it impossible for my makeup to cling to like my dry patches. But yeah, it feels absolutely disgusting on your face. And like, I don't know if I would really recommend that for like the reason. But if you have really dry skin, it like creates a film and like your makeup doesn't sink into your skin, which I really, really like. And that's like the one thing that I love about it because it's like... I don't know it's pretty much the whole reason why I love it because like my dry pouches used to like cling to makeup and like look like I don't know it was disgusting <laughs> if you have really dry skin I would recommend this a lot I have eczema on my face and my dry patches they come out of nowhere and then they're just like here I am like look at me I always get them around my mouth and like on my cheek right here so yeah but so far I still have dry patches this isn't doing anything but it's not clinging my makeup to it which is great also by elf I actually have a lot by elf okay uh, is the elf 16 hour camo concealer I've heard that this is like the shape tape one I've never tried shape tape so you can't take my word for it but when I say this is the best concealer I've ever tried I mean it it's also five bucks so like can you really beat it um, it comes with a lot of product like and also the doe foot's huge like it's, I think that's why people think it's like ta uh, shape tape the product might also be but I don't know if I've tried it but um, I get the shade light sand if you were wondering next thing is the covergirl clean normal skin pressed powder I don't have normal skin but when I say that this is amazing I mean it it honestly it's probably just like any other powder I think I got it at TJ Maxx or Marshalls and um, yeah, it's really great. I really like it. It's probably just like any other press powder, but again, I don't use um, products that are tested on animals, so it's kind of hard to find a lot of brands that aren't insanely expensive. <laughs> so CoverGirl and like Elf are like my two favorite because they're a drugstore. Next, speaking of Elf again, I got the Elf Mad for Matte palette this month. I think actually in like the beginning of the month and I have not stopped using it. Specifically, I really like the third color in the palette just because I put this all on my crease and then like on my lower line. I don't know what I'm talking about. But, um, or my waterline or whatever. And I really, really, really like this palette. I feel like it's very blendable. I would definitely recommend looking for this at TJ Maxx. It's honestly not that much more expensive from the actual brand. But 
if you're cheap like me and like to get a steal on things, I would definitely recommend TJ Maxx because I got this for $3.99. The last favorite I have is actually something I used to use in middle school and obviously most of you have already used this product before and it's the Wet n Wild Walking on Eggshells Trio. I guess now it's not a trio, I guess it's four colors, but I only use the eyelid color. I use it with that e.l.f. shade and I put this on my eyelid and I really, really, really like it. Like a lot. I think it's really amazing. Also, again, it's only like three bucks, so you really can't beat it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That is all for my September favorites. There are a lot of other favorites that I clearly talk about, but these are the ones that I definitely think you should either look into getting for yourself or even like thinking for like a Christmas present for somebody. Like everybody could use a vacuum or like a tripod for their camera, like things like that. And also Norwex is a great Christmas present. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment down below any other videos you wanna see. Like, comment, and subscribe. I just said comment again. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.